What's up, fellas? Welcome to Code of Conduct. I'm Mike, and on this episode, I'm going to show you how to take advantage of a gold digger before she can take advantage of you. So there's women out here teaching each other how to use the legal system to marry rich, successful men, take all their money, their house, their children, alimony, and child support, basically ruining a man utterly and completely. So what I'm about to show you right now is going to level the playing field a little bit. So here's a video that demonstrates what I'm talking about. Here are some tips for gold digging from a Toronto divorce attorney. One, start dating someone with a higher annual salary than you. Can't be digging for gold if the person is making the same income as you and has the same net worth as you. Am I right? Number two, if you're moving in with that person and not planning on getting married, start contributing small amounts towards rents or utilities. They could potentially be construed as you paying towards the mortgage. You never get married, you may have a potential constructive trust claim. In the event that you have the option to get married, get married. I mean, isn't that the gold diggers flex? All right, guys. So that's actually advice coming from a divorce attorney. She's teaching women how to use the legal system to take advantage of men. This is something that I came up with in my cybersecurity days and me chasing young hot women. The way this works is you wanna leave your laptop open, you wanna be logged into your bank account and leave that somewhere where the gold digger can see it. Right click on the page, go to inspect, that'll open up the inspector, come up here to the top and click on the cursor icon and then go ahead and click on your account balance. That'll open up the section in here in the code. Go ahead and hit that drop down. Go ahead and edit your bank balance to what you want. I mean, you gotta be a little realistic with these numbers, obviously. Let's go ahead and call it 8,340,278 dollars and 21 cents. As you can see here, that changed the balance. If you have a business account, you can do the same thing with that. Go ahead and close the inspector window and leave this window open for her to see it. She's going to take a look. And the best part of this is that when she hooks up with you afterwards, you know that it was based on your account balance. She saw the money. She thought she was going to take advantage of you, but it didn't work out. It didn't go her way. So, you know, every little bit helps, guys, because the world is generally against men. The legal system is against men and they're helping women take advantage of us. If you found this video helpful or entertaining, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button because I got a lot more videos like this coming up. <laughs>